In these two problems, we're going to set up our two variables, write our equations, and then solve our equations. So we're going to use a system of equations to solve both these problems. So for the first one, it says two small pitchers and one large pitcher can hold eight cups of water. So one large pitcher minus one small pitcher constitutes two cups of water. How many cups of water can each pitcher hold? So it seems like a lot of words, I get that. But if you guys look at it one sentence, one piece at a time, the first thing you guys should hopefully be noticing is that they're talking about pictures. So I'm going to make my two variables, L and S. So L is going to be a large picture, and S is going to be a small picture. You guys are more than welcome to use X and Y. I just feel like in when you do that, on top of figuring out the problem as a whole, you then also have to remember, okay, which variable is X and which variable is Y as you're working through the problem. So I just like to use variables that I'm going to be able to work with a little easier. So the first sentence is your first equation. It says two small pitchers and one large pitcher can hold eight cups of water. So two small and or plus one large pitcher has a total or can hold a total of eight cups. Then it says, okay, well one large pitcher minus one small pitcher constitutes two cups. That is your second equation. One large minus one small. is two whole cups of water. So what I'm actually gonna do is I'm going to rewrite this one, this equation, for S. Like I'm going to actually, we're gonna do the first one, I think. We're gonna rewrite this one and solve it for the L. So if we subtract two S, over to the other side. This becomes 1L equals 8 minus 2S. So when those two equations are what you have left now, so I'm actually almost going to cross that one out because we're kind of done with it. Now you can substitute that 8 minus 2S into your L, because 1L is just L. L equals 8 minus 2S. So let's do that. We can do and use substitution. So 1L, and instead of the 1, I'm just going to substitute in 8 minus 2S minus 1S equals so we've got 8 minus 3s equals 2. Subtract the 8. Negative 3s equals negative 6. So when you guys divide, 6 by 3, you get s to be 2. So that's the small picture. So we need to plug in S to find the large picture. So again, it doesn't matter which equation you guys plug it into as long as it's one of the original. So 2S plus 1L equals 8 or 1L minus 1S equals 2. doesn't matter which one you plug it into there. I'm just going to plug it into the first one, 2s plus 1l equals 8. 2s, which is, we now know is 2, plus 1l equals 8. So 4 plus l equals 8, minus 4, minus 4. So a large picture 
equals 4. So at the end, I just sort of like to make sure you guys include your units. So we're sort of talking about cups. You don't need to write that, write it out in sentences. But the large pitcher holds four cups of water, and the small pitcher holds two cups of water. So why don't you guys try the other problem or the second problem there?